An early morning shooting has sent one person to the hospital, and eyewitness news reporter Lauren Hensley is live at the scene in Wilkes-Barre, where police are investigating at this hour. And Lauren, what can you tell us? Chris, police are still trying to piece together what led up to that one person being shot and also what led up to this. A small, dark-colored SUV right behind me crashed damage on top of the curb. So let's go ahead and take a look at the crime scene video from earlier today. So around 2 o'clock this morning, police were called to the report of gunfire to South Main Street and West South Streets. That's near the federal building in Wilkes University's campus. Police confirm at least one person was taken to the hospital with a gunshot wound at this location. A crash also happened in which an SUV went over a curb and took out some traffic lights. According to Wilkes-Barre City Police, there's still no one in custody at this hour. And if you're traveling throughout the downtown area, you want to be mindful of this. There's police tape all along South Main Street. So you're going to hit a lot of road detours, a lot of the side roads also closed. So you're going to have to maneuver around this um, crime scene here as Wilkes-Barre City Police continue to investigate. Now going on behind me, we are seeing them bag and tag evidence. They are collecting evidence from that dark colored SUV you see here, here behind me. So still an active scene several hours after they were called here around 2 o'clock in the, in the morning in Wilkes-Barre. Reporting live, Lauren Hensley, Eyewitness News. A major road closure this time of the morning. Lauren, thank you.